Three cricketers with the surname Schillingford have played Test cricket for the West Indies. All from the same fishing village in Dominica. Grayson Cleophas Schillingford paved the way for the other Schillingfords and was really a pioneer of Dominica cricket excellence. He played for West Indies between 1969 to 1972 and he played seven tests. He also took 15 wickets. Irving Schillingford was a gifted batsman who made his first, his first class debut at age 16. He was so gifted that he made his debut so early. He is a cousin of, he is a cousin of Grayson. He started his career in 1978. He is a top scorer of 120 against Pakistan. And he would have played more test mas matches had it not been in an era of some other dominating West Indies batsmen. And by far, maybe the most accomplished of the Schillingfords is Shane Schillingford, who was really a special test cricketer. 70 wickets after, after 16 tests. And this include five, this include six five wicket hauls and two ten wicket hauls. Unfortunately, he was called for an illegal bowling action and that dampened his career. Just imagine how many wickets, how many more wickets the Dominican might have had if he had played 50 tests. So there, there you go. These are the Schillingfords of West Indies cricket. All from the same country, all roots from the same fishing village in Dominica. Please remember them.